Hi everyone, it's Antoine from Tribulant Software. I uh, want to show you how to uh, log in to your email account online and then also how to set up your uh, email account in your email client. So to access your webmail, go to your domain uh, forward slash webmail, like so. And uh, you'll be presented with this screen, so it'll either uh, go to secure or non-secure, depending on what your computer allows. Uh, in my case, it goes to this port, which is 2096. And then uh, you're presented with a login screen, and you just log in with your email account and the password as you set it up in your uh, cPanel. So once you log in, uh, you'll actually be presented with a, a screen to select the webmail that you want to use. In my case, I've already configured that to a default one, so it actually redirects directly into the webmail interface. Uh, you can easily change that here by choosing a different one. And you've got some other options uh, at the top here as well, like autoresponders, calendars and contacts, uh, password, security, configure mail client, etc. So uh, to set up your email client uh, on your computer, such as Outlook or Mac OS Mail or uh, your mail client on iOS or whichever, you just go to this configure mail client and it gives you um, some configuration scripts. So, for example, uh, on uh, iOS, uh, it gives you Mac OS mail and you can literally click on these links and it's going to create a configuration file for you to download. And once you open it on your computer, it will install all the necessary settings and everything for this email account. Uh, if you're on Outlook, you've got some configuration files here for Outlook as well. And if you scroll down a bit more, uh, you'll see uh, manual settings. So the username, which is the email uh, address, and then the password, which you set before, and then incoming and outgoing mail server. Um, you can use either the domain or you can use mail dot like this and you can use um, secure settings like in this blue box or you can use non-secure settings like in this yellow box and you can also have your email instructions emailed to you uh, meaning this uh, these configuration files etc so that's it the easiest way of setting up is actually using these configuration files uh, once you install it. Uh, the only thing you need to do is enter the password for the email accounts as it is configured in cPanel and that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye.